So many of our clients are working abnormal hours. They're working before eight, after five. They want self-service opportunities that they could take and use themselves without having to pick up the phone and explain themselves. And I understand right now is so crazy that you're trying to juggle so many balls in the air. Sometimes it's nice if you can just learn how to do it yourself or, or do a couple of quick clicks and send something on your way. For us to be able to continue to innovate in the ways that we want, relying on our digital resources will be imperative for that innovative side. And that's just not something that we can do because it's obsolete in just a small, small amount of time. And distributors find that to be a friction filled experience, right? Yeah. They want everything that is exposed to them to be accurate and to be right. And our team internally that was doing that, they're humans. They're not graphic artists. They make mistakes. We fat finger, fat finger things. It's just yeah. natural. So mitigating the risk of us potentially giving something to a customer that could set a bad expectation from them to their client was important to us. And so we're really trying to adopt ways that we can make sure that we give the best data, the best service, and the best tools available and digital to us is the way to do that on the second prong. Yeah, that's awesome. Yeah, we, um, back in the day when we launched Zoom Catalog, we'd go to some trade shows and we would see at the end of the show, just piles of print catalogs being thrown into dumpsters at the end of the show. And it was one of the motivating factors on developing a system that we could distribute catalogs on. So it's amazing that you guys are recognizing that impact and doing your part in cutting back while providing tools that are possibly even more effective. And as you said, up to date and have accurate information.